welcome back future medicos in this video we are going to talk about sri siddhartha medical college at tumkur and sri siddhartha medical college at t begur both these medical colleges are affiliated to the deemed university sri siddhartha academy of higher education located in karnataka so we are going to look at the fee structure of both these colleges for the year 2020 so right now i am in the website of mcc that is medical counseling committee where the registration is going to start tomorrow so the information for all these colleges have already been more or less updated so i am going to compare the information available at the mcc website and the actual fee structure so this will give you some indication of what kind of surprises you can expect in colleges when you go there will it be exactly the fee that is shown in mcc or will there be any difference should you be prepared for some surprises so that's what i am going to show you in this video just stay with me until the end of the video now let's look at sri siddhartha medical college tumkur if you look at here the fee structure shown for annual fee the fee structure shown is 15.65 lakhs okay 15 lakh 65750 rupees is the annual fees and if you look at the amount to be paid at the time of admission this is also shown as 15 lakh 65750 so it's the same fees no difference and the monthly hostel dues is shown as 10300 rupees so this is the fee structure shown in this particular website that is mcc for the college siddhartha medical college tumkur now i am going to show you the fee structure as shown in that particular deemed university website so this is something i have downloaded from sri siddhartha medical college tumkur website and this shows the annual fee structure for the year 2020 21 now if you look at here the tuition fee is 15 lakhs other fees 37750 university fees 28000 so so far good these are all fine there is nothing wrong so far but now what is the difference where is the difference coming the difference is coming here there is something called maintenance fees so if you look at their website there is something called maintenance fees which is 2 lakh rupees you need to pay at the time of admission so i'm not sure whether it is just at the time of admission or is it an annual fee because here on this website it shows it is an annual fee structure so if it is an annual fee structure if you add everything it comes to 17.66 lakhs so at the time of admission if you are not taking hostel still you need to pay 17.66 lakhs so i want you to clarify with the college whether this is an annual fee or do you need to pay only 15 lakhs every year or do you need to pay all these component if you add all these component this comes to another 2.66 lakhs now let's look at the hostel fee the hostel fee is 1 lakh 24000 for the entire year and then don't forget you need to pay a caution deposit of 1 lakh at the time of admission so this caution deposit might not have been shown in the mcc website so you also have to take note of this that you need to pay a yearly 1 lakh 24000 mess and establishment charges plus 1 lakh rupees caution deposit So if i add this all together it comes to about 19.9 lakhs you need to pay at the time of admission so don't just go with the mindset that i need to pay only 15 lakhs you need to pay around 20 lakhs that is 19.9 lakhs you need to pay at the time of admission for siddhartha tumkur now how many seats are available at siddhartha tumkur siddhartha tumkur has 150 seats available for MBBS. Out of these, 85% of the seats will go to uh, All India General Category, 
and then 15 percentage will go to nri category now let us look at siddhartha t begor okay let's look at t begor now once again look at here the t begor uh, this is siddhartha t begor information provided in the mcc website once again here they have provided the annual fee as 15.77 lakhs the amount to be paid at the time of admission is 15.77 lakhs and the monthly hostel fees is 10,500. So this is the information provided at this website. Now let us go to the actual information provided by the college itself. That is Siddhartha Medical College T. Begur. Let us look at what exactly is the fee structure they are showing. Okay. So here you can see here, this is the information I have collected from their website. It shows the fees to be paid for the year 2020-21. Now, if you look at the tuition fee, that's fine, 15 lakh rupees. This is as shown in their uh, as shown in the MCC website. There is an institutional fee of 49,000. That's fine again. University fee 28,000. So these are the three components that is shown in MCC website. But you can see again here, there is a maintenance fee. Okay, there is a maintenance fee of 2 lakh rupees you need to pay so including this the 2 lakhs if you add you will be paying about 17.77 lakhs 17.77 lakhs which is 2 lakhs more than what is shown in the mcc website and then if you are opting for hostel then you need to pay 1 lakh 24 thousand rupees as hostel fees per year and then you also need to take note that you are going to pay a caution deposit for hostel which is equivalent to 2 lakh rupees right so you need to pay a caution deposit of 2 lakh rupees at the time of admission so if you add all these it comes to about 21 lakhs so once again i want you to be very clear with what you are getting into if you just blindly look at the MCC website, you may be thinking that you need to pay only 15 lakhs or 15.6 or 7 lakhs at the time of admission. But the actual fee you will be paying to the college at the time of admission will be equal to almost around 21 lakhs, including hostel. Of course, the 15 lakhs shown in the MCC website, they don't include the hostel. If you include the hostel, it comes to 21 lakhs. So you need to be mentally ready to pay these 21 lakhs if you are choosing this hostel once again it's not very clear what exactly is the annual fees okay whether the 2 lakh rupees is going to be repeated every year whether the 49,000 and 28,000 is going to be repeated every year it's not very clear so the minimum you will be paying around 15 lakhs and the maximum you might be paying around 17.77 lakhs so there is a difference of about 2.77 lakhs which you make sure that you understand and then select this college in your choices and the number of seats available in siddhartha t begur there are 150 seats again and uh, um, 85 percentage of the seats go to general management category and 15 percentage of the seats go to uh, nra category and one thing I want you to take note, there is a huge increase of fees for Siddhartha T. Begur from last year to this year. Some of you may be thinking that last year it was one of the cheapest colleges and then with that mindset you may be selecting the college. But make it clear, there is an increase of 4.5 lakhs from last year. Last year the fee structure announced for uh, Siddhartha T. Begur, I think it was only around 10.5 lakhs. Now this year it is 15 lakhs. So keep that in mind when you are doing your calculations. Another thing I want you to warn uh, about Siddhartha Tumkur as well as T. Begur. Last year they were charging about 35,000 to 40,000 at the time of admission for medical kit or welcome kit, which included some of the textbooks, um, stethoscope and some of the equipments that are needed for you at the time of admission. 
So add that 35,000 to 40,000, probably they may be charging this again this year, which is not shown in even in their website. But maybe there may be a surprise at the time of admission. They may ask this. I'm not sure. I'm just guessing that. So keep all these in mind when you are selecting the college. Do the calculations correct. That's what I wanted to tell you. Don't just go blindly by what is the fee structure shown in MCC website. And another important thing you need to take note in both Siddhartha Tumkur as well as Siddhartha T. Begur, you need to give a bank guarantee. Okay, take note that you need to provide a bank guarantee. Now, how much bank guarantee should I produce? You need to produce a bank guarantee for the fee structure of three and a half years. Right? The fee structure for three and a half years, you need to produce a bank guarantee. So that's approximately equal to 52.5 lakhs. That is 15 lakhs multiplied by three and a half years. So one good thing, as like most of the Karnataka colleges, Siddhartha is also charging only for four and a half years. So for three and a half years, that is for an amount of 52.5 lakhs, you need to produce a bank guarantee. So take note of that. Keep that in mind also when you are signing. Okay. So this bank guarantee should come from the bank authorities. So you need to get some bank authorities and then see how they will give you a bank guarantee of 52.5 lakhs. So they will not just sign this document. Probably they will ask you to produce some uh, fixed deposit or maybe some uh, you need to pledge uh, something. I'm not sure. I'm not sure exactly what is the procedure. So keep these in mind again that there is a bank guarantee for both uh, Siddhartha Tumkur as well as Siddhartha T. Bego. The amount is the same in both. In both uh, the amount is three and a half years, which is 52.5 lakhs. So I hope this information gives you some clarity on how to choose medical colleges for choices in deemed universities. So I already have done a video on this exact topic. What are all the things you need to keep in mind? The 10 things you need to look at when you are selecting deemed universities. So this is another example uh, where you need to be very, very clear what you are going for. The information is available. It's only thing you need to search and find it out. Thank you very much. I hope to see you in some other video soon. Until then, take care. Bye bye.